Welcome back everyone. Today we will continue our shampoo showdown and in particular we're going to take a closer look at Dodo Juice Sour Power. Another product line I would like to take a closer look at amongst many others and even pumping out a video just about every day it just seems like it's it's taking a long time to get to some of these products but be patient. I do want to take a look at others. Uh, Polish Angels, Sonax, Dodo Juice, um, Car Pro, and many other uh, brands. So, in particular, we want to see if the Sour Power breaks into our metals table, and this is what we have. Nano Skin Hyper Suds, a great price, will do everything you ask of a car soap. We have Masterson's Mystic Snow Foam, Silver, Angel Wax, Angel Wash, Bronze, Honorable Mention goes to Poor Boys, Adams, and Gion Foam. So, without further ado, let's take a look at Dodo Juice Sour Power. Dodo Juice Sour Power comes in 8 ounce or 250 milliliter containers for $14. It is a pH neutral, highly concentrated shampoo infused with wax grade carnauba. The pH is 7, you can dilute it 500 to 1, it's highly concentrated and all of their products are made handmade in small concentrated batches. It's extremely thick, has the consistency of molasses or honey and has the strong smell of sour apples. We're going to go ahead and put just under an ounce in our IK Foam 9 Foamer. I'll put a link down below for that. Incredible for rinseless washing or washing when there is no hookup or no outlet for water. Very rarely head out in the road, but when I do, I'll pack this away with the Works Hydro Shot, a bucket, a few mitts, a couple gallons of water, and I don't have to search for a water hookup. The IK Foamer will foam just about anything, any type of cleaner, surfactant, and it doesn't matter if it has gloss enhancers or canuba, just like this concentrate does here, which will kill some of the foaming action in a foam lance, but with the IK Foamer, there's no problem whatsoever. produces thick clingy foam and actually the whole shop in this corner over here smells like sour apple Jolly Ranchers. Had I been on the road I would have started rinsing with the Works Hydra Shot but to save a little time I'm just going to grab the electric pressure washer and give this a rinse after letting it dwell for a few minutes. This is what the Sour Power will look like for those of you with electric power washer setups and a foam lance. Actually not bad with gloss enhancers and carnauba. Usually kills the foaming action and leaves it a bit runny and thin, but not bad here. Actually one of the best shampoos that include either carnauba or gloss enhancers when it comes to foaming action. Which is good, you want it to cling to the vertical surfaces, give it a chance to encapsulate some of the loose, gritty dirt, and then rinse it off. The product has a ton of lubrication that are really cut down on the marring and swirls. I'll let that dwell for 10 minutes or so, come in, give it a thorough rinse, and move on. We have the contact wash to do yet. We're also going to hook it up to a 3100 PSI electric power washer. Okay, moving right along, we're going to get our wash bucket ready. I have one wash bucket, 
a few gallons, three mitts ready to go, and no rinse bucket, no wasting three to five gallons for a rinse bucket, and no silly grit guard. The product gives a lot of suds in your wash bucket. I have three mitts in there from the rag company, the 10 by 10 Cyclone, and two that are very similar, uh, just regular wash mitts. So I have a foam lance hooked up to gas powered pressure washer, and the foaming's a little bit better, but again, with the gloss enhancers and carnauba included, it keeps, uh, it keeps it knocked back a bit, but not bad at all. So with my wash routine, after I pre-wash it, I will foam it again, let it sit for a couple minutes, and then start the contact wash. I grab the 10 by 10 Cyclone, do the top half of the car with that, the roof, the hood, windows, trunk, a little bit of the front and back. I'll put that to the side to get cleaned, washed, and dried later. Then I'll grab the mitts and take care of both sides of the car. A dirty wash mitt will never go back into the wash solution. And when I'm finished, the solution is crystal clear. And if I have enough, I'm going to keep it, cover it, agitate it later, and wash another car with it. The wheels are done beforehand with uh, an absolutely separate wash bucket and all the other tools that go along with wheel cleaning. When you're washing... Use the mitt in straight back and forth motions. Try to avoid circular motions and start at the top, work your way all the way down to the bottom, bottom of the rockers, wheel wells, and give it a thorough rinse. If you have a quick disconnect system, disconnect the lance, plug in your rinse nozzle, point it to the ground, test it so it doesn't fly onto a car, chip the paint, or break a window, and continue to rinse the car. So some final thoughts on the Dodo Juice Sour Power. If it came in 500 milliliter or 16 ounce for the 14 bucks instead of the little 8 ounce container, this would probably be a top shampoo. It does a great job cleaning. You combine that with the gloss enhancers. It's uh, high quality carnauba. Gives the finish a little bit of pop when you're done drying. Uh, it's a very solid shampoo. So taking everything into consideration, it may not climb all the way to the top and be king of the hill on the podium, but I'm definitely going to use this again. Okay, gang. Again, Dodo Juice Sour Power. A very good shampoo. Works great, smells great, uh, performs well. But at $13, $14 per 8 ounces or 250 milliliters, it's not quite going to break into our, our podium, into a podium position. And this is where it's going to stand. It's going to stand with NanoSkin at the top yet. This has been our reigning champion for uh, a couple weeks now. Masterson's Mystic Snow Foam is a very close second. Another great shampoo. Angel Wax, Angel Wash, awesome. We are going to put the Dodo Juice in the honorable mention spot along with Poor Boys and Adams. So if you're not worried about price whatsoever, any of these will do a great job. These are incredible shampoos and tops for me. This is my list right here. So if you have any questions at all, don't hesitate. Brian from Apex Detail, catch you in the next video.